Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Just don't give a little pokey to my finger. Oh my god, that one came close. Okay, hold on, y'all. I ain't no way Edgar gotta beat me. My pinky! What's going on, my lovers? My name is the Ball of Landry, and welcome to a new indie horror game. This is called Who Wants to Be a Murderer, and I'm pretty sure that this is supposed to be like a Steve Harvey's cousin or something like that, but this is a 90s game show horror game that has like a really dark, twisted secret underneath it, so hey, I'm really excited to jump into it. I hope y'all are having a great week so far. Let me know down below in the comment section, and go ahead and give me a high five. And enough talk, let's do it, baby. So enter name, we're gonna put Don Malovin. There we go, we're gonna press play. Now I've heard that this has, uh, okay, warning, sensitive content. Okay, we all have been warned. Host. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome, welcome. I didn't get to read the shits. Okay, today, my dear viewers, we have the most intriguing case of characters lined up for you. But enough from me. Let's dive right into and meet our first participant, shall we? And now from the bustling metropolis of Chicago. Yo, that ain't too far from where I'm at. I'm just saying. We welcome Sarah Thompson, journalist. Oh, we're going against multiple people. Okay. Let's have some fun and games. Do we know about what's really gonna happen? Okay, I don't like how the dialogue is going really quickly, y'all. My slow rest reading is horrible. Okay, there's uh, Richard. <laughs> Let the games begin. Let me guess, I'm the last person? Unknown skill and determination of a true gamer. That sounds about right. Hello, everyone. Greetings, folks. Hey, oh, I get to choose my shits. Our wild card participant. How do you know it? <laughs> hey there. Greetings, folks. Let's just call hello, everyone. How about that? There we go. Is that supposed to be me down here? <laughs> Hello, everyone. Ready to shake things up. And, of course, our final contestants need no introduction hailing from the foggy streaks of where? Where whispers in the occult echo through the night. What? Bitch, what is that? Edgar Darkwood. Oh. Is this supposed to be, like, the one they all love? <laughs> the one that, like, multiple appearances? There you have it, dear viewers. Okay, cool. I like the vibe to this. Where is this gonna go? Ready to battle in this arena, so sit back, relax, prepare yourself for a journey, let the games begin. I wish I had the ability to, like, actually click the shits instead of, like, it. Okay, whatever. Welcome to the first phase of the show. This is where we separate the wheat from the chaff, the knowledge seekers from the more mortals. Is that what that said? In this round, your gray matter will be put to the test in every correct answer. What? $10,000, I think that said? Let's delve into the delt, shall we? Your question awaits. Which medieval torture device famously... Yo, bitch, what? What are we talking about here? Which medieval torture device famously used to stretch limbs and torso? Why do you want to know? Uh, it's not the... Is it the Brit? No, it's not the bull. It's not the guillotine. Is it the Iron Maiden? I think it's the rack. It's the rack, isn't it, y'all? And the answer is... Is it the rack? Correct! Yes! Okay. I don't know why I'm so excited about getting a torture device. Okay. The rack. Okay, my boy really gonna give us a lesson about what the rack is. Richard, here's the question. Oh, shit. We are legit competing. What is the name of the mythical creature said to lure strangers? What? Mermaid Siren... Kraken Leviathan. He don't know, does he? My guess is Kraken. Wrong! So what happens if you're wrong? I'm curious. The Siren. Never knew that. I'm glad I didn't get that question. <laughs> In the Middle Ages, what deadly disease spread by fleas, rats? That's a plague, isn't it? It's the plague, I'm pretty sure. Tuberculosis. <laughs> Yo. R.I.P. Arthur Morgan, just saying. Bubonic Plague, wasn't it? Yep, Bubonic Plague. And the answer is... Correct! Okay, y'all, I feel... Oh, shit, it really gave her money. Okay. So right now, it's between me and Sarah, huh? Time to shine, Edgar. Why do I feel like they favor Edgar and give him all the shits that's under the, like, the table? They give him all the answers or something? Okay, I didn't read it. Some of this dialogue goes by so quick, I can't read it, y'all. Spanish flu, black death, scarlet fever. Yo, what is it? Elden Ring? He's, what is he about to say? Spanish flu. And the answer is... Wrong! My boy got it wrong! Yeah, who's the favorite now, Edgar? If that is your real name, I don't even think that's your real name, Edgar. That concludes our first round. Mind-bending questions, folks. 
And with that, I'll be taking a short break for us. Uh, yo, we're really going to a commercial break. I do forget that this is a com like a TV show. Yo, what what network we on, by the way? I feel like this went straight to Amazon or something. Yo, what am my boy talking about? I literally went on a spiel and he's talking about some knife or something in the shits. Okay, my dear competitors, we're off the air for now, but fear not. If you need anything, anything at all, you know where to find me. Just don't keep me waiting too long. Yo, bro, what is that? Yo, get your goofy ass Steve Harvey. Oh, we can talk to people. Okay, what do I talk to him about? So, are you ready to continue or do you need a... No, let me talk to everyone else. I want to talk to everyone. With this knife game coming up, who knows what'll happen. I heard Sarah's not handling it too well. Maybe she'll ponder makes me through one people. Yeah, what? What are we talking about knife game? I don't know if I can do this. I'm scared. What if I mess up? What if I get hurt? Uh, you're stronger than you think. We can find a way out. What do you mean we can find- Are we doing this with, like against our own will? Or is this like something that we voluntarily did? I would like to know we're stronger than you think. Let's- let's root her on. I'll be that team player, y'all. I'll be the team player, okay? Okay, let's do this. Okay, what about Edgar? Why does he talk like that? Ugh. Ready for the night game? Just remember to take it slow and steady, yo bitch. Okay, y'all, let's talk. I think we're ready. We're gonna do the night game. Kind of concerned of which uh, network is gonna be airing some night game up on their TV channel. Okay, excellent. Let's stay back in. Ladies and gentlemen, we are back on air. Before we dive back in, here's a quick shopping tip. Shopping tip. Yo, who's watching this? There ain't no grannies watching this show. I'm just saying. There ain't no way grannies are watching this show. Okay, time for our first mini game of the evening. Courage will be put to test. See if they take what it takes to handle a little knife play. Here are the rules. Contestants will have 30 seconds to score as many points. What? They must touch the table with the tip of the knife. Avoid. Oh, is this that one game where you do the knife on the on the hands? Y'all know what I'm talking about? Oh, gosh. Yo, we using butter knives? Nope. Okay, nope. This is not a butter knife. Oh. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Just don't give a little pokey to my finger. Oh, my God. That one came close. Okay, hold on, y'all. I ain't no way Edgar gotta beat me! My pinky! Oh my god, y'all. Oh my god! I literally just lost all of my shits. <laughs> I hope I ain't needing that hand in 12 years from now. I did come in first place, though. Yo! Yo! <laughs> the first elimination. Oh, please. That ain't, there ain't no way it's gonna be me. I'm in first place, y'all. Come on now. Come on. Edgar's bitch ass better go first. Oh, oh, where did she drop to? Was that a chainsaw? A buzzsaw? What just happened? Now the game truly begins. Yo, Edgar, no one asked you. Yo, we just literally watched Sarah get dropped down to the pits of a buzzsaw or something down there. Whoa, whoa, whoa. yo. Okay, 10,000. We'll be able to earn 10,000. Feel free to speak your mind. Okay, let's see who will rise to the occasion. Or falter under the justice. Okay, I don't even know what I'm reading anymore, y'all. My boy talking so fast, I can't even keep up. Next question. Okay, questions. You witness someone poisoning a stray animal. How do you respond? Should I answer this at le Oh, God. I don't know if I should answer these questions in my sense or in his sense of the game. Offer to refine their technique for a fee. Rush to the aid the animal. Ignore it. Nature is taking its course. Confront and report the perpetrator. I don't know. I, I don't know. I feel like these are all logical things, and this is the only thing that's not logical. So I'm gonna go with the only thing that's not logical because this son of a bitch wants me to, doesn't he? Okay, do that. Yo, my money just increased. To be compassionate or to profit from misfortune, that's the dilemma. I got money from that. Was that the right answer? I think that was the right answer, y'all. Alright, I have no idea what my boy is talking about. Read it, return it, use the information to your advantage, respect the owner's privacy, read it out loud on a live stream. I feel like he wants us to answer the bad things, right? Use the information to your advantage. Yep, okay, yep, he definitely wants us to use the, the shits as a... God damn, he got 20, 15k? Too bad for Sarah, she ain't got no more. Okay, you must choose an execution method. What criteria? What? What do you mean? Choose efficiency in the minimal pain, maximize spectacle and fear, advocate your dignity and compassion. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. What's my boy Edgar gonna say? Inflict slow agonize. 
How are these correct answers, y'all? These are psychopath answers, y'all. That's what these are. All right, folks, that wraps up the second round of questioning. And my, my, we have peeled back some layers. Now we've got a glimpse of the real deal. They've sized each other up, and believe me, they're sharpening their claws for what's to come. Bro, what does that mean? Voting phase is up. Oh, stay tuned. Oh, they better not vote me out. What do you mean? What do you mean voting? Who votes? If you're watching at home, don't forget to call your toll-free. Okay, my boy doing a real good job of being the son of a bitch. <laughs> this has got to be a fake audience. There ain't no way these are real people. Things are about to get interesting. The shadows deepen. Well, folks, it seems like we're off the air if you need to know. Okay, I get it. I get it. Just don't keep me waiting too long. I, My boy, I got you. I got you, my boy. Let's see what Edgar has to say. Watch your back. Yo, bro. What did I do to you, Edgar? What did I do to you? So it's come down to this, huh? Tell me, should I trust you over the other contestant? Yes, absolutely. Did you just hear what bro said? Edgar the champ. Yo, he ain't the champ today. It'd be risky for you to face off with him in the finale, wouldn't it? How about we vote him out and clear a path for us? Yo, I agree. My boy Richard, I agree. Okay, let's do it. I am definitely voting this son of a bitch out of here. All right, so are you ready to continue or do you need another moment? I'm ready. Excellent, let's dive back in. Yo, this is actually lit. <laughs> okay, welcome back, folks. Okay, the voting round. Here's how it works. Each player will cast their vote on who they believe should be eliminated. The contestant with the most votes will be out of the game. Yo, so it doesn't even matter who won the most money? How is that fair? They could just not like me. Oh, uh, yo, you I already know this son of a bitch is gonna vote me. Yo, Richard, I'm 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 trusting you, Richard. Who are you voting for? Get Edgar's punk ass out of here, Richard. What about you? Yo, no hesitation. Yes. Oh my God. Yes. <laughs> okay. It doesn't matter. Why even ask him? He's two to one. All right. We have a winner, or should I say, an eliminated contest? And oh, yo, that bitch dropped. <laughs> Oh my god. Okay, each correct answer, 25k. Each answer? Enough chit chat. Yo, bro, we better be doing this at least for a milli if my life's on the line. Time to shine. Here's the question. All right. What is the approximate volume of blood loss that typically leads to death in an average adult? Yo, what? Bitch, should I Google that? So it said 40 to 50%. Okay, there we go. Answer is correct. Let's go. Thank you, Google. <laughs> Okay, life's essence is a difficult matter. Okay, yep. Next up, Richard's question. How long does it typically take for a lethal dose of cyan? Yo. Yo, ain't no way my boy getting it right. One to two hours, five to ten minutes. Fifteen to thirty minutes. Four to six hours. I feel like it's got to be pretty quick, huh? My boy really got the answer right, y'all. Are you kidding me? Yo, we really going against the smartest man alive, Richard, over here. My boy didn't even use Google. Okay, last commercial break before the finale. Two finalists will engage in a duel filled with thrills. What do you mean a duel? A real bloodbath of entertainment. My dear contestants, this is your last chance to catch your breath. Hope you're handy. Okay, handy with a rifle. My boy said what? Oh, God. Uh, yo, bitch. I lost like four of my fingers from earlier, so I don't know how well this challenge is going to be. Just saying. All right, here we are. No more games or tricks from now on. It's just you and me left, but I'm sorry. I'll be the one. Okay, well, I'm glad you're so confident. Luckily for you, I've had my share fill of Call of Duty in the past, so your ass is grass, buddy. Ladies and gentlemen, we're back on air. We are about to find out who will be the winner of this exciting night. But before we die back in, here's the last shopping tip. There you go, grannies. Get your fill. We about to show this chump how it really is done, y'all. We're really about to show it. Okay, the initial phase of questioning, we tested our testament, t contestants' knowledge and encouraged the knife mini game. Okay, he, my boy is just recapping right now, y'all, to the ones that, you know, were, like, actually doing something with their time instead of watching the psychopath. There's just one more final step to truly define yourselves as such. Action. All right, let's put deeds to words, y'all. You'll be armed with a rifle in 30 seconds. Whoever manages the... He said what? He said what? Oh, yo. Oh, yo. Yo. I hope these aren't real people. No, there's no way. There's no way. There's no way. Okay, this is dark. Okay, sorry. Sorry, Karen. Sorry. Bob, you were a good man, but I need the money, man. Just saying. Yo, this is horrible. 
Yo, there ain't, there ain't no way my boy is out beating me, though. Just saying. Ain't no way Richard's gonna be able to... By the way, this isn't a rifle. This is a shotgun. My my boy needs... He's asking us all these questions. He needs to get his shit correct. Come on, give me the money. Give me the money. Yes, we did it. I feel horrible. All right, folks. It's time to announce the... Uh, well, come on. It's me. It's me. But before we do, let's give a round of applause for our brave contestants and their... um. Uh, Valiant efforts. Now, without further ado, our champion, or should I say our. Yo, he's really begging. Sorry, Richard, buddy. It's about journey, the thrill of the hunt, the adrenaline. Oh my gosh, this game is twisted. Let's not forget the sweet, intoxicating scent of what? He said what? Ending three of four, murderer. Okay, so that was a uh, that was the ending to the game, y'all. I want to jump into this one more time and see if we can get like another ending. I guess there's four of them. I don't know if I'll get all of them in this in this in this game. I guess we'll see. Okay, what is the name of the infamous prison known as the Devil's Island? Yo, how like different is it? I'm gonna put Devil's Island. I'm gonna guess everything wrong, y'all. And the answer is wrong. Oh, yo. <laughs> yo. Alcatraz is where the most incorrigible... What? Okay, bitch, I don't need a, a history lesson. Okay, y'all, so it seems like the mini games are the same. I wonder what happens if I lose this. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Yo, I hope I don't plan on playing any games soon. Not after this. <laughs> there we go. Great. Great. Let's make sure we get them all a couple times. There we go. I got one. <laughs> 26 Jesus yo they about to drop my thick ass I think they're about to drop my thick ass y'all unfortunately soul bidding adieu tonight is no other than they really dropped my yeah <laughs> okay y'all I think I'm gonna leave this off here I like this a lot I think like the style of it is really really cool the idea of it is really really cool it is very very dark so they were not kidding about that warning section at the beginning. Overall, this was like actually low-key a banger. My biggest complaint is that there's just... Uh, there's a... Uh... Okay, never mind. I'm just an idiot. Anyhow, let me know y'all y'all thought of this game. If you enjoyed it, make sure you leave a like and subscribe. Thank you everybody so much for watching. With all of that being said, I will see you... In the next video.